Hello everybody, Fatimix here. Welcome once more back to Let's Play Getting Over It with Bennett Foddy. This is the uh, umpteenth episode of this series, but the second one of me paying the penalty for falling down the snake. And of course, riding the snake. Yes, I did it on purpose. If I had to do over it, I'd do it again, because it's part of everything. It's part of completing uh, every part of the game. So... But, yeah, I'm definitely hoping that I don't have another fall like that. And, of course, right now, the main thing is the one part of the game that I really haven't uh, even come close to mastering yet would be Orange Hell. And getting past that again, um, I had a decent attempt and a stupid fall and an okay attempt, uh, basically, last time. So I got there three times. And let's see if I can possibly do any better with this today. I'm hoping so. But you never know what's going to happen. Some days are good, some days are bad. But, you know, the directional control on my jumps really wasn't working there the second half of that last episode or so. Hoping to have a little bit more of that working well for me. At the very least, I'm going to do my darndest to get lots of attempts up at Orange Hell and uh, get a little better at it. And if I get by it, then I should have pretty good shots at progressing back up to the bucket area where the snake is and, of course, the farthest point of progression for me so far. So. That's our goal, at least, for today. Whoa! Oh, my goodness, I was up there and then snagged it the wrong way. Um, but that was that was a nice, fast uh, jump up there. Actually, almost a little too fast. I couldn't get the hammer where I would normally have it in time. So, really surprised by the velocity there. And uh, ended up being a little bit too much. So, let's just roll on right back up there, right? No problem. We're just going to stop falling off the umbrella. We're going to stop falling off. Stop falling off the umbrella, I said. There we go. Uh, nope, nope. We're not going to stop falling off the umbrella. We're going to do it again. Oh, my. Nope. Definitely a very bad and a slightly too early release point on that. It's okay to go straight up, it's not okay to fade away from the target. I think I can do it about as well, frankly, just by continuing to, to roll up there as I can by resetting down in the rake area. I just don't think that's really helping me, at least not anymore. Did at one point. Probably no longer uh, useful though. Okay, way too much bounce there, but still a successful transition. See if I can get one over here. Good attempt last time that yet managed to not work. Okay, I will take that as being quality. Not great, but not terrible either. Thought I might end up slipping down a step. Up, oh, nope, nope, nope. Rotate up, rotate up. Come on, you can do it. There it is. Just trying to reset my uh, position here. Want to lower down more, get more uh, more thrust on this. I need a good jump. There we go. There and there. All right. All right. Not bad. Passing the steps in just a few minutes there, and see if I can navigate the five jumps. Well, not, you know, not at all great. Still had a chance there if I could have held on to the camera, but 
No, 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 no. No, do not do that. Okay, then. So, yeah, we're definitely not fully in control here. Ooh, pushed off and then managed to snag the camera there with the tip and grab a hold. So, nice little save. Work my way down here to a decent position for a strength jump. Need to get quite a bit into this one. Well, not the best swing over with that little hitch in it, but it definitely worked. It was more than enough for the task at hand. And yeah, that jump I definitely pushed off to the right. Which I don't want to do, especially on this next one, but again, good enough. Of course, it's important to work on not being just good enough for the current jump, but ironing out these little quibbles in your technique, because some jumps are not as forgiving as others. Wasn't sure I was going to really be able to hook up there, but I did. And so let's just work my way up here. I said work my way up here. There we are. And jump number five. That's the, uh, the correct, uh, not necessarily correct, but the position that I use for this. Very nice. Good technique, good timing on that. Got the direction I wanted. All that fun stuff. So. couple uh, modest hiccups, but moving on to Orange Hell right away, which is what I want. And, um, you know, times like this, I just try to remind myself, look, it only takes one successful attempt. That's all I'm looking for here. I don't even care if it's lucky, frankly, at this point. I want to succeed once. Let that orange roll around down there by the window. I am through with it. Okay, and of course, I had the problem last time, once when I didn't even jump. You have to make sure you do this enough to actually jump. Don't, uh, don't uh, you know, uh, just sort of wimp out of it and just try to get the small hop and reach up there. You want to get a bit of a distance on the jump. Yeah, just like that. Smooth rotation over. There's plenty of time for it. You just got to hook the top and on we go. I hope. There. I just want to make sure I'm setting nice and close to this rock. Again, right there is the pivot point. I want to be above that. Right about there, I think, is about as good as any spot is. This one, it just doesn't pay to sit there and dawdle um, very much. Getting up. Okay. So, smooth progress, generally, to the critical moment. Which is about to be here. And it's real easy when you're on an angle like that to just push away. So, you got to be ready to counteract that. The pivotal moment has arrived. And I could be on my way upwards in less than a minute here. I could very well be on my way downwards very, very far as well. So I want to, nope, I want to make sure 
that I've got maximum extension here. There we go. Hold it, hold it. Okay, that was nice. I realized I wasn't high enough, and I just waited to fall, grabbed up as close to the top of that rock as I could. Very, very happy with this. Getting past the Orange Hell section, and I'm less than 10 minutes in already, so I should be able to do lots of good things here. And you never know when you might screw up something. But I am expecting to pay a visit to the bucket fairly shortly. So, obviously we do not want to assume anything that we have not yet achieved. I just want to try to rotate this, let the hammer just come around, let it come around, and be on that, because I want to, obviously you want on the flat surface to jump. And this is just a straight and modest jump up. Then I need to hook our wonderful friend above. Very, very good. Very, very good. Then I need to do it. No, uh, don't. I'm just sort of leaning up against. What am I doing? I want to let myself down. Yeah, I'm just leaning up against the building, and I don't want to be there. I want to come back down and it's always you're always at risk if you try to do this too fast bumping off the building and then just going flying off somewhere so I want to jump off the ear really just like I want to jump off the thumb up there as I did last time and now I want to try to rotate out so I'm balanced. Rotate out. Please rotate out. And I'm just I'm just being really careful here as I was before. I have the same sense of danger. I could easily fall here. And I want to make sure I don't ram into the building. And that when I swing over to grab the hand there, I do I don't do so wildly. It's got to be done under control. Yep, just like that. That's what I was worried about. Doggone it. Oh, I didn't lose everything, but I lost most of it. And I pushed off the building. It's the first part of the time I've screwed up in that section. Shoot. I need to be a little bit more controlled in the swing over than I was. So, I get to do Orange Hell again. Oh, I'm trying to get the hammer out a bit more and it doesn't seem to want to come. I think that's a little better. Well, I'm sure I can get it to be almost if not straight up. Oh I had it! I had it and I just didn't like I, I froze basically there. Still I like that uh, that idea. I, consistency I've gotten there. Can I do it again? Set down because the hammer just isn't over far enough. I want sort of the to be, I want to be a little bit away from the wall because now now it's a straight up and down. I have to get a far enough away from not the wall but the the rock there to be getting a straight up and down motion. I'm just sitting here. This is ridiculous. Um, okay. I don't even know what to do with this. I'm going to try to just power, power off of this right here. Nope, not going to work. Okay. 
Because I didn't want to try to push straight down. Because I don't think, I think that would push me away as well. So I, I seriously don't know what to do with that. I, I didn't know that was possible to balance on that steep of a slope. Nope, I don't want to. I don't want to flip it around that way. I want to come around this way. Oh, and I really don't want to fall back down again. I want to get past this here, this time. <sighs> hold it. Nope, not gonna hold it. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. All right, just slip down there. Yep. And grab. There we go. Okay. Had the hammer. No, 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 no. Okay. Had the hammer up on top of the ledge again and just a little too much bounce in it. I mean, I'm really happy about the con. Uh, no. The consistency here in getting up to the ledge or close to it. But, there's also the, the mindset where that could go sideways on me at any time. So I need to take advantage of this while I'm experiencing it. Let's try again. Nope, don't do that. Yep, I wasn't quite there. Oh, no, 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 catch. Dang it. That's painful to ha do all that and just come back down. That is painful. Of course, the way you punch the game in the mouth and let it know you're not going to be defeated is you, you simply... Come on, we'll go off. You simply get right back up there. Well, let's see if I can manage that. Well, I like that. That's a good jump. Good transition to the steps. I should just need one relatively basic hop here. Very good. Okay. And that that's about as easy as I think that part's going to get for me. If I could do that consistently... And I'm handling the steps quite well today, so I'm happy with that element. Nope. I uh, had good control of the hammer, came over there, fell on the camera, but then could not hold the position. There we are. The question is, is it going to get lodged, or is it going to... Oh, it, it did rotate over for me. Okay. Jump number two. Too bouncy for my liking, but one can be overly critical, and I made the uh, the conversion there. Good, good, good. Not as much room for bouncing on that one. That's part of the increasing difficulty. And that is about as good as I've done that. That was very nice. It was straight up. It wasn't left. It wasn't right. I was able to reach far up over to like the second uh, rung. Rungs, of course, being formed by the upside down cabinet, but whatever. That was very good. I wasn't even in the perfect position on the toilet, but that was nice. So I'm feeling very, very good about my control in most things. A little bit off on sticking the landings, but I'm happy with how this is going. Happy to just, you know, basically spit in the game's eye and say, yeah, yeah, I got up and uh, fell down, and guess what I'm doing? I'm coming right back up, right back after you. It's like just a couple minutes later, and boom, here we are again, back to the platform for Orange Hell. So that's, that is exactly what I was looking for. Oh, almost blew. I did blow it. 
Oh my goodness, I had recovered, and then I almost fell on top of that car on top of the mouse mouth, which I've never seen before. I'd actually like to be over there just for the heck of it, just to see that. But, uh, ugh. Oh, that is only the second time I've blown that, and I could have saved it. I was under control and thinking everything was okay, and then bounce. So, not, uh, not thrilled with that. No, 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 don't. Don't. Dog, on it. I was there. Oh, I, sh I should have held that first, that first one. I should have been able to hang on to that landing. Actually sitting on the rake for a second there allowed me to just reach up instead of doing a swing. I like that. Nope, not that far over. There we go. Yep, far too wild on that. But again, it ends up working. No, 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 come on. Rotate, rotate in the proper direction. That's it. Very nice. Oh, that's even one higher than I normally get on my good jumps. I will take that. That transition over to the steps, I will take that every time. Easy hop up. Now let's see if I can handle the jumps here as well as it, yep, didn't. But I really did this section, I think I, in total, I've never done it as quickly or as easily as I did it last time. So that was that was excellent. Probably not also not something that's going to be consistently repeated. But maybe I can get closer to that being my standard approach. And of course, best of all would be to stop having to do it, period. Because I'm further up the mountain. No, 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 no. Oh, just just hang on the camera. Give it to me. Give it to me. Let me rotate up. Let me rotate up, please. I'm running out of space for my mouse. There we go. Now I can position. Ugly. 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 And yet successful. That is exactly how I'd like to be doing that one. Not quite as good as last time, but very good nonetheless. Straight up and then reaching over. That's the ticket there. Last time I sort of lost my launching point here. Here I'm right where it wants to be. And very, very nice. All right, now what do you say we don't? Uh, no, don't do that. Okay, I've never actually sat up here, and I don't want to sit up here. So let's see if I can just shove myself over. Yeah. So let's see if I can just sort of not screw up the very beginning uh, platform jump, which I, I do seem to be getting worse at it over time. Just one of those things. Had a little trouble there. No, 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 don't. All right. Now that's not what I want. There, that's what I want. Goodness, the simple things like that can still find their way to be aggravating. Right there is where I want to be. Push off, rotate over. Okay, so let's make this. Uh, let's make this simple, shall we? Just a simple little hop up there. 
Don't overcomplicate it, if you please. Alright. Step one. Complete. How about step two? No problem. And how about number three? Yeah, a little bit too much English on that. Don't fall! Don't! Don't! No! Oh my goodness! Oh, that was so stupid. Oh, that one, I just... That's in my top five of stupid things I've done in this game. Because that just should never... That There are mistakes you make that you don't normally make, and then there are mistakes you make on parts that are just hard. And that's one of the mistakes that you make that you just should never. By this point, I should not ever, ever, ever be doing that kind of nonsense. Now, those are the ones I just want to smack myself for because of the price that you pay for it. There's no guarantee that I'm going to be able to, I mean, I probably will, but that I'm going to be able to get back up there, um, navigate the steps, up the landing, the five jumps, with any, you know, without any significant problems. And even if I do, I'm still just blowing time. Gives me less time later to work on conquering Orange Hell, and if I do that, then going further. So, yeah, okay, now I'm going to have to, I caught it, but I'm going to have to uh, work from a lower point here. Haven't worked from this far down in a while. So, this jump right here is going to be real important. and excellently done. I got up there in the air at the peak. I pretty much I was able to stick Oh, don't do that. Lost a step. I was able to stick the hammer over onto that top step um, at the peak of the jump. I really couldn't ask any more of that. And then here we are. Once again, so the, se the, uh, the steps almost been the greatest bane of my existence over the course of this game, those steps have been the greatest single one, and I am now at the point where, like, they're, frankly, routine. Which is rather astounding to me. Like, I literally did not think that was ever going to happen. I thought I was going to struggle with them each and every time. So, so far we're doing just fine on these jumps. That one, a little bouncy, and I had to really make a nice uh, hammer maneuver there in the midair to salvage it. Nope. Okay, well. We're back to two. <laughs> what in the world was that nonsense? I was straight up and down. That's not the goal at all. Let's not lose. Uh, let's not lose our control over our jumping here. There we go. Pushed the hammer a little too far over, but I was able to just hold it there against the wall and not, not shove off. And of course, the angle on this sofa makes it easy to bounce. A little harder to stick it, but. Uh, that wasn't too bad, huh? That was that was that was iffy. Not even gonna say it wasn't. Oh my goodness. Okay, yeah, that one I just I wasn't aggressive enough with a hammer. I, I I was right there, so that was just a self-inflicted wound. Let's stop futzing about with us and get up these jumps, shall we? Okay, not at all what I meant, and then I almost did two for the price of one before falling back down. Yeah, too far to the right and not even close on that. Let's uh, let's elevate a bit and get back to more of this kind of an angle. Yeah, that's what we want. That's what we want to see out of that jump. Now 
Messed it up again, but really was able to swing up there, even though I was just holding on the very edge. Okay. Nope. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Oh, my goodness. I think I saved it. I think I did, in fact, save it. Whew. Do not like the jump. I love the uh, the hammer work and saving it, though. If I could do that kind of thing more often, I would be much more accomplished at this game. Oh, I was there, and I was just too, a little too careful, a little too cautious. Didn't get the hammer over in time. That's more like it. Not perfect, but it worked. More than enough to work. Let's just extend out. I, I like the idea of sitting on this chair. I think I might want to try that a little more often, and then... I'd like to just bump myself off. Not like that. Nope, nope. Okay, that that's a bad idea on second thought. Okay, so now I'm sitting... Yep, I'm sitting up there. I just want to... I've done this once before, unfortunately. Been down here. Yeah, let's just pop ourselves up there. Okay. So yeah, sitting on that chair and pushing off of that... Uh, whatever it was below... In retrospect, I'm sort of stuck here, but in retrospect, I'm literally stuck. I can't, okay, I was like, the cauldron wouldn't move, um, any direction, but anyway, in retrospect, that was not, uh, not a brilliant idea, and it's one that I don't think I want to repeat. So yeah, I believe this is at least my fourth attempt at Orange Hell today. I'm liking that number, and of course, I actually passed it once. Still annoying me that I'm spending this much time on it after having passed it for just the second time ever. But perhaps I was a little fortunate the first time through that I didn't screw up any of those jumps. Just past Orange Hell. So, very nice uh, transition here, up to the fourth and final uh, section. And, yeah, I'm not quite over far enough. I really want the hammer position to basically be precise. Because I want that right there, you can see it's bisecting the color, and I want the, the, the straight up and down. Anything other than that... I'm afraid I'm going to bump off the rock or something. Oh, and I was just... Yeah. I had it, again, if I could have held it. Nope. Okay, first time I've messed that up today. So let's just... Yuck. Nope, not what I want there. Very nice. I like the power I got in that. That last swing up here. I can't quite uh, get that post. Fine, I don't need it. I'll use this one. Good grief. Why did I jerk off of that landing way, way too quickly? See if we can do this again. Nope, not that time. I may be doing pretty well with it, but I'm clearly not immune to royally screwing it up, either. Oh my... Oh my... Oh! oh. <sighs> Almost disastrous. Hard to believe I've only been at this for a little over half an hour today. It just seems like it's been 
so much has happened for a relatively short time. Okay. Now we're a little safer. And now we're on our way back up. Right where I'd like to be. Come on. Swing up onto the post. No, no, no. Oh, my goodness. No, 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 no. Oh. I was trying to adjust, and I'm like, I had it. No, I want to go back. No, I, I've got a hold of it. It's just, ugh. Should have. Another one of those parts that just, I should basically be beyond screwing it up by now. Nope. Let's not let's not be down here playing with fire. You know, being down here risking uh <laughs> okay, risking falling past the steel beam is not even a thing that I want to be doing anymore at all. So at worst, I want to be, I've just fallen off orange hell. You know, I want to be up there by the slide, then moving seamlessly over to the shelving and going after the steps and everything after that. Like, that's, those are the, I want those to be the bottom, right here, the bottom of my existence. And, okay, that came a little bit faster fall than I was expecting. But I need, that's another just out of control swing. Yeah, that, that, that wasn't controlled either. I'm just, maybe I'm at that point starting to lose a bit of control. Oh boy, there's a just silly hop. All right, I will do that if you want. Wiggle off, there we are. Alright, now let's see if we can make this one of the good attempts. Most of my attempts at the steps have been quite productive. Oh my goodness! That was, that was even better than, than I think I've done that before. I will take it. And let's see what we've got here. Can I get back up? And three for three, oh, almost three, for, I was three for three, and now I fell back down to the steps. Great. No, 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 don't, why are you sliding down? Rotate up. Ugh. Goodness, that was just, that was just bad. And I almost blew it. Take this down. Ugly, ugly, ugly. I don't know what that was, but I know it was very, very not good. There we go. Okay, maybe I can just break through that by just forcing it over. Very nice. I like the fact that I didn't have any bounce on that. It just stuck there and held. Too much on that one, but did have just enough room to make it work. Of course, that's the kind of bounce that on the top of Orange Hell or whatever, 
or on the top of uh, like the anvil jump, it's not just inconvenient. It means you fall. Number five here. Not as much height as maybe I would have liked, but uh, it definitely worked. I want to try to find a smoother way of doing this part over here. So maybe if I set myself down, setting myself down on the stair, on the on the uh, top of that chair, it didn't work. Maybe I set myself down just before it and swing over here. I think that's what I want, and then just shove off in some manner. I really should, as long as I'm swinging the hammer over to the left, um, that doesn't have to be graceful, but that'll be effective and reasonably quick, I think. So, once again, back to the platform. Known for its color and its fruit. Okay, I almost shoved myself off that second rock, but I didn't. Almost screwing up is just fine, just as almost succeeding is still not succeeding. I'm sliding down. Let's get... Uh, Right there. Right there, that's the spot. Come on, stay up. There we are. Okay, perseverance rewarded at least for the moment. I think I can just sit on this, even though it doesn't look like I should be able to. Okay. So... my second completion of orange hell and I feel confident that I can pass it now like not consistently by any stretch but it's not as intimidating as it was even say earlier today but I need I need to control the hammer swinging over on these next couple three jumps that's what I need to make this stick. And that's exactly a bad way of doing it. Fortunate to still be up here because I was in position and I just didn't move the hammer over enough. I was didn't want to thump it off the wall, so I did the opposite. I didn't grab a hold of my target. I did it again. Oh my goodness, I'm both lucky and really wanting to punch myself in the face frankly after that couple those couple of jumps ooh hoo hoo well i'm still in position but boy there we go and that one i've got to swing over more aggressively i think this is the one i want to be more cautious on which is interesting i'm not going to put it on the ear this time we're just behind the ear there we go, and I want to go straight up and then be cautious on the swing over, but I do still have to grab the thumb. Of course, this is the one that I messed up on last time. And did it again! Doggone it! I did just save my spot up here, but that's twice Past orange hell, I've screwed up on the thumb jump because I'm swinging over too far and hitting off the building. Got to try to err a little bit more in the other direction on that jump. Not on the one before it, but on that one. So they are a little bit different. And I, I, I got it right the first time I did it. And now I'm uh, 0 for 2 since. But... Can I just get right back up there with this? All I need is a single jump or good recovery and uh, vault off the rock below if I don't get it in a single jump.
There we go. There we go. I did it again twice in a row. Wow. Break out the champagne for that. But you can't break it out too much because I've still got to not screw this up. Okay, now I can be a little bit more aggressive again, as I've been saying. I'd be a little more aggressive on the swing over on this one than I can be on the other one. In fact, I need to be. There we go. Oh, that was that was a lot more than I wanted. Not much of a jump, but I did get up here. Okay, I'm just going to sit here for a minute. Reset my thoughts, because I have a feeling... So the success or failure of this episode, um, I've done some good things, but really the ultimate success or failure of this episode, I'm going to feel about it. It's probably going to come from this jump. I've got to get past this little uh, issue here with the thumb. There we go. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Didn't jump enough. I was really disjointed when I came over, but so what? I made it. I made it. Let's, uh, yeah. Oh, well, that's actually right where I want to be. It's not how I wanted to get there. I was planning on fully setting myself down first. But on this next one, I need to make sure I get a good jump, and then I want to be pretty aggressive on the swinging over, because I need to make sure that I get, I want to get plenty of height, and I want to make sure that I get over far enough to the right to, to hook it. Of course, that means I could send myself flying, but I'm far more worried about not getting over there far enough. I've got to get over, yeah, I've got to get over to the right after I lift off here. So, here goes nothing. Oh, almost pushed off, didn't quite. Just let it hook in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not worried about you this time. And I don't see a good reason not to do, as I did last time, just move over here onto the tip. And then just go off at more of an angle. This one, really hard, I think, to get that lip. I'm not real confident in grabbing the correct, uh, grabbing uh, cautiously. Which is going to be a problem here because I really need to not shove off the steeple. And I basically feel like if I get this jump, I've got it. Like I'm moving on forward. Uh, yeah, and see, I was just being too cautious there. You can't let fear of screwing something up make you just not do it. Okay, it's okay, just... All right. Yep. Just kind of sat there on the on the angle. Let's rotate over very cautiously so that we're keeping the hammer there. And I can't just push myself over. It's just high enough that I've actually got to do another jump here. But I just want to swing over, make sure I hook the other side. I don't need a great deal on this. And should be able to make that happen. Yeah, I didn't do hardly anything with the jump, but I didn't have to. Come on. Well, I want to hook this like more up here. And then just let me get over. There we go. All right. And now we're moving right again into relative safety. And this right here is just no big thing at all. Up and over, up and over. This is, of course, where I've fallen a number of times from above, and I'm getting my hammer stuck for random reasons. Hmm, this is the next little bit challenging part. I've spent some time on this. Got to get a good jump that's away 
and then, yeah, then come around soon enough to grab the ice there. Yep. And that one I just kind of pushed myself away, lost some velocity on the jump. Which is not what I want. And that one, yeah, that's too far away. So you've got to find just the right jump vector from here. Nope. So this one I could uh, I could be flailing against for a bit. Hopefully not, but I definitely can't say it isn't going to happen. Oh, almost. I feel that was the closest attempt I've had yet here. If I don't get this pretty soon, either whether I get it or not, I'm, I'm almost at the end here, time-wise. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. Now on to the anvil. I'd like to get over, because I think, just think it would be a good way to finish this. I'd like to get back over to where the bucket is. Which I can do, but only if I don't screw these up. Up, oh, not quite far enough. There we are, that's where I want to be. No! It was a little bit, I pushed myself a little too far to the right on that. Yep, same there too. I mean, I had full extension when I reached up, and it was, again, just a bit too far to the right. I'm not sure why, but I will have to put more effort into getting more vertical. That's too far off. There we go. Oh, didn't quite get there. And yeah, I think I'm going to stop it here. Um, we're coming up on an hour for this episode. And this isn't a bad place to stop. Because starting at the anvil means that you got to put in a few attempts. You're going to most likely going to put in a few attempts. Should have a good handle on um, not being rusty with the controls when I go on to the next part. But uh, I'm excited about the next episode because the next time I play, I should be able to get up here, get over to where the bucket is, and at least be making attempts at getting further in the game than I've ever gotten. And once again, with the snow caps, I feel I can't be that far from the end. So thanks, everybody, for watching, those who have been sticking with me through this. And we'll see you next time, which will hopefully be soon.